Hey, I am Jessica Owen, and I have always had a handful of amazing individuals who really inspire me. One of them being Brian May, from Queen. Last year was a really dark and painful year for my family and I. To escape the physical pain, I needed something to focus on. I decided the ultimate adventure I could invest my energy into was to have a conversation with Brian May. And blow me away. It actually happened. His wealth of knowledge absolutely intrigues me. Being non-verbal a great deal of what I am thinking goes unsaid, because it is just too time-consuming and physically painful to type. So the majority of my good friends are chatterboxes, who I am happy to listen to. I absolutely love it. Brian has the exact same quality, spend 5 minutes with Brian and you will walk away with a library of knowledge, an astrophysicist and a musician, those titles say it all. However, I was a little concerned, whether he would understand the whole, non-verbal element of my life. I experienced so many people talking down to me when, they first meet me. They assume being non-verbal, is a intellectual death sentence too, which it is not. I have experienced so many weird reactions, sadly it has evolved into my way of life. I was wheeling past all of the Queen sound equipment. Thinking to myself, this is so unbelievable. How am I even here, standing next to the Queen crew? Then I was waiting for Brian to arrive, I was shaking with nerves. Then Brian walked in, Jess, nice to meet you, I will be back in five minutes, then we can have a chat. I was over the moon that he just spoke directly to me, in a normal tone. I was so excited by that one sentence. I was thinking to myself, I can't get too excited, or my spasms may rip out my new hip replacement, calm down. Brian returned, and he was so good with me. He concluded within himself that my mind is absolutely fine, and my iPad is my communication device. We spoke for so long, I had some questions prepared on my iPad. During our conversation. My left arm was spasming covering the iPad. He calmly pushed it down, so he could read what I was saying. He was so brilliant. If you haven't heard the story of Brian's Red Special Guitar, look it up on YouTube. He made his first guitar out of things in his childhood home. It is not just a normal guitar, this thing has the ability to speak to you. His motto is if you are going to do something. You need to do it correctly. I have the same motto. I wanted to share this amazing experience with you, to illustrate how to communicate with a non-verbal individual. I am lucky I am a really confident person, who will cope with any type of reaction I receive. However, there is many non-verbal people out there, who are shy and take it to heart, when they are ignored, or spoken down to. So if you come across a non-verbal person, be a Brian May and simply start up a conversation. Their faces will come alive, because you spoke directly to them in a normal tone. Cheers Brian, thanks for giving me this amazing opportunity, and allowing me the time to communicate, in my own unique way.